What do you to this support share speaks? And I just want to talk. I just want to be first off. I say, rest in peace, to Tyree Smith or Tyree King. If I apologize if I get that last name wrong, I apologize. Um, he is the latest victim of police brutality. He is the latest victim, slain victim of a fatal shooting by police officers. I'm not aware of the location at this moment. I just received word of it. And my condone, my deepest condolences go out to his family and his friends, you know, that associate himself with him. And I just wonder, I, I shouldn't be asking this question as to why this keeps happening. Because it's obvious why. Because, you know, it's that imposed agenda that so many people are accustomed to and taught, you know, that's just rooted in their brains. But I really wish this wouldn't happen to young minorities. I really wish it would stop happening because now before anyone else says talk stars begins to talk about black on black crime, let me just give you a little fun fact. Black on black crime does not exist. Okay? It does not exist. You know what to do, you know, it does not exist. Okay? Black on black crime is the result of oppressing putting people in oppressive situations and limiting them systematically you know, basically, you're rationalizing every opportunity they have. You're limiting them. Food, clothing, financial stability, all of that. Healthcare, all of that. That's what black-on-black black crime is. And the reason why, and the result of what I just said prior is a result of why you see, unfortunately, my young brothers and sister, sisters killing each other. It's because the system was designed for us to be oppressed. Not rise up against. But the ones who do rise up against, that's great. But this is what you're speaking, you know, like this video. Tell me what you guys think about this in the conversation below. I love y'all.